Holiday is here today at Marie Kerr Park. Signing autographs for Highland Youth Football. Oh, he's, that's gonna be and I'm here with a couple of brand new friends. And I'm introduce yourselves. Tyrone, Christopher, Eric. Okay, Tyrone, Christopher, and Eric are here. They're part of Highland Youth Football. They're the reason why Ron Holiday and Dennis Dyer and a few other drivers are here. And I'm going to start from right here. Uh, tell me, tell, why do you, why do you think of this, uh, this old big shindig for everybody? Uh, I think it's nice that they're doing this because. I don't know, the players deserve it. Tell me, how are you guys doing this year, and what do you think of what's going on today? Uh, don't be nervous. Don't be, don't be nervous. Well, I think it's pretty good because all of the race car drivers came to see us, and everything, we came to see them, and they just came out to see um, and we came out to see them, and everybody came out, and I think it's real nice that they did that. And I'm still alive, but I found a few more friends, like Coach Eric of Highland Youth Football, coach of the sophomores, undefeated, I understand. Exactly, 6-0. It's been tough, you know. We uh, have a bye this week. Uh, we play uh, Little Rock next week, it is. Yeah. Yes, coach. And looking to go all the way this year. That's right. Okay, I'll go all the way, but this, this event has been a really shot in the arm for you guys, having a great season and having Ron Hardy Jr. here come out and give... Give you guys, raise you guys some extra money, right? Go to Vegas. We sure appreciate all the help we're getting this year. It's a lot more this year than since I've been here that I've seen. So we really appreciate all this for the kids. I have Larry Nassen here. He's a track announcer for Mesa Burn Raceway and will be at the Super Truck Race this Sunday. Larry, hey, I'm surprised to see you here. Well, we, you know, we support Ron Horn today in the Papa John's Pizza Chevrolet, and we came out and, uh, to help Ron today, and, uh, of course, uh, we're all rooting for him to win this championship. And uh, I'll not only be announcing Sunday, but we've got Ron for four days up there, so we're looking for a great race at Mesa Marin. That's right, and what do you think of this, of this turnout today for Highland Youth Football? It's really amazing. Well, Alicia Dyer did a great job bringing her people here, and I think that uh, it just shows that there's a lot of interest in motor racing, uh, and motor racing is a sport, and we want to keep our kids uh, in school and playing football, and then hopefully after the football game they can come out to the racetrack. But the coaches and all the staff from Highland uh, uh, have been incredible to us, and that's why we brought this rig here today. I mean, you know, normally you don't just get one of these at your request anywhere you want in the country, but uh, because Ron's local and Alicia, you know, has been uh, with Ron for such a long time, uh, also being related to her. Uh, we just thought it was a, a little present we can give to the people of Palmdale to bring the super truck here today. The things I do for this job, folks. Make sure you get your free Papa John's keychain. All right. All right. Well, thanks a lot. This is Lindy Hornaday, folks. Hi, and thanks for everybody coming out today and supporting the Palmdale Youth um, Football League and um, my kids coming out and Dennis Dyer and Ron. Let me see that. I don't have this one over here. Second time out of Yeah, when well, I'm done. Five minutes. Okay. Finally, I made it to the table, folks. I'm here with Ron Hornaday III. Ronnie, congratulations on a great season at KCR. Thank you very much. It's my luck. Ron's not here, but... I do have somebody else here. This guy I've been trying to get an interview for a long, long time. His name is Dennis Dyer, Southwest Tour driver and a member of the Palmdale Posse. Dennis, finally I got you. Now sign this thing, please. <laughs> don't, don't try and embarrass me here, Rick. No, no, no thank you. No embarrassment here, folks. There it is, Dennis Dyer. You sitting out there, make feel, make you proud, then we'll come on, all right? Get that time. Third, huh? Hey. Nope, you got to get in line, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Back door. I'm going to get you. <laughs> you got home. Finally, after waiting for hours and hours, I'm finally going to get my poster signed by the one and only Ron Harday Jr. Ron, welcome back to the Antelope Valley. Nice for you to be here. Well, it's, uh, I'm glad to be back here. Uh, the fans, the people, everything's great. And it's kind of where I grew up from and made my home track. So... Uh, it's just neat to see all these people come out here and, and support the youth football, and uh, just proud to be here. Yeah, also, too, this is also your first aut autograph session with both your kids who also race. Well, I don't know if that's harder or easier, but uh, it's glad to see my kids. I haven't seen them in six months. I've been in North Carolina, Mooresville area, and uh, doing a lot of racing right now, and uh, missed half their seasons of racing, and uh, hopefully we can get something bigger and better for uh, back there in Mooresville. Okay, well, thanks for your time, Ron, and nice of you to be here, and good luck this Sunday in the Super Truck Race. I'm Rick Rivas, and I'm here with one of the cheerleaders of Highland Youth Football, one of the young w ladies that we have out here who's having fun today with the autograph session. And what's your name, honey? Bonnie Shamblin. Bonnie, are we having a good time here today? Great. 
And what do you think of these race car drivers coming out for your uh, program? I think it's great they're out here. That's, we have a surprise guest right now, and hopefully we can catch him before he leaves. Frank Moronsky Jr. of Henson & Henson Racing, number four. He's talking with some guys from Papa John's. See if we can horn in their conversation here. <laughs> Frank, nice of you to be here. Yeah, it's not too bad. Coming out to see Ronnie. Yeah, that's, it's been a while since you last saw him. I think it was uh, well, one of the Southwest Tour races, I think, right? Uh, yeah, it would have been a serious point. He's been back east for quite a while now, so came out here today. I saw the big truck and stuff, so. That's right, and hey, I understand that this is your old race car, the street stock car behind it, um, right, to side of it. <laughs> yeah, that was uh, our first stock car, so when I used to race at Mesa Marin, and we sold it to Ronnie the Third as part of a trade deal, and we got one of the one of our new tour cars, so it's working out real good for him out there at Kern County. And what do you think of this uh, impressive piece of machinery right here, the Papa Tron Super Truck, the Chevrolet? Uh, he's, Ronnie's really been tearing it up lately there in the Super Truck Series, so it's really good to see him. He's worked hard his whole life. It's good to see everything coming together for him right now, and Hopefully he'll do it again this weekend at Bakersfield. Yeah, now also you got your own race at Bakersfield Friday night. Yeah, the Henson and Henson number 40 olds. Yeah, we'll be out there Friday nights. Our biggest race, 300 lappers. So you know it should be real interesting. Whereas we're looking real forward. That's our home track. So we'll be there and hopefully you know try and finish out the season real good. Okay, Frank. Thanks a lot for stopping by. Now we met Ryan Horday a third earlier today and on the TV show. But now I have as part of his crew right here. And uh, which one's the crew chief here? Matt. Okay. Yeah, I understand you had a great season at KCR. Um, tell us about it. Uh, I don't know. I liked it. It was pretty fun my first time. I enjoyed it, especially to us. We all did it. So. Yeah, what have you learned this year about uh, this, having this your first um, experience in racing? I learned a lot. Uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I just learned a lot working with Ron, Ronnie, his pop, uh, Bill, John, all of them. Yeah. And guys, so you're out here for charity, the Highland Youth Football League, and yeah, what, what do you guys think about being here? I think it's good that um, Ron and everybody's out here doing this for the kids. There's not a lot of stuff that they can go and see or whatever. And I think this is a great thing for them to watch. It's on TV all the time. There's a lot of nice people in it, and it's a lot better than doing all the stuff a lot of the other kids are doing. Thank you. Oh, I got it. Hey, you kids, will you hold down the fort for a minute? Come on, Mickey. K-E-R-R-S-T-Y-N. 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 K-E-R-